Today I celebrate my first thumbs down on YouTube. My first reaction to this was, oh finally, a different like ratio than 100%. It gets so boring seeing 100% time after time after time again. Someone decided to spice it up and change it to 90%, which was Fascinating. Well, it wasn't exactly 90, it was a more interesting number than that. And so my thought was why they wanted to do this. Maybe they were just someone who wanted variety, you know, thought that you need sort of a yin and yang to the universe, some sort of a cosmic balance, and they were trying to achieve that. Maybe they're just people who they like, they derive satisfaction with giving videos thumbs down. If that's the case, you know, that's certainly an interesting type of person. I'm not sure if I'd want to meet one or not. Uh, maybe, I mean, this, the song, is, uh, and maybe I'll put that right here, the song is Robert Day, which is a Kurdish folk song. Maybe they really dislike Kurdish music. Uh, maybe they're actually a Kurdish nationalist, uh, and I didn't play the song well enough. And if that's the case, Please forgive me. I, you know, I, I just tried my best. But one reason that came to mind, one reason that came to mind, uh, is YouTube changed their terms of service. And in this new terms of service, they can put ads on your videos. So you upload a video and they can put an ad on it, even if you don't want any ads. Uh, and they're within their legal rights to do that. This is their platform. If they want to do that, if they want to censor videos, all that, they can legally do that. That's fine, but it's a little bit annoying. So, uh, so what to do about that? So here's my recommendations. Number one, if you come across one of my videos and it has ads on it and you just out of the generosity of your heart say you know what i'm gonna watch these ads all the way through because that will give me as the creator of those of that content extra money if that's the case you're a very generous person but in my case i'm actually not even eligible for monetization so all you're doing is giving money to youtube if you want to do that that's your decision you know but if you're the kind that feels guilty about skipping ads in this case please don't feel guilty Secondly, if you hate apps, maybe consider watching my content on NVIDIAs. That, and you can get a list of instances at nvidio.us. Uh, there, there's also CloudTube, which uh, uses a rewrite of the NVIDIAs back uh, end. 
Uh, the thing about that is if you do that, I won't see your view count. It won't go to that. You won't be able to like the video, and you won't be able to comment. So that's really too bad. Oh, well. Uh, but I definitely, you know, if you weren't going to like and comment anyway, you know, definitely check that out. Or maybe you weren't sure if you like it yet, then check it out on that. And if you do, then just go to YouTube and watch it and like it there. Okay, so the other thing is all my videos are licensed CC, that's Creative Commons Licensing, uh, That and that's CC, that's CC4. And what that means is you can redistribute it, provided it's under the same license and you give credit. Now, so if you want to mirror this on another platform, or you know of another platform you'd like me to put content on, leave a comment down below. Uh, first of all, that's totally okay with me, mirroring it on another platform. I would appreciate if you left a comment, so maybe I could register with that platform, respond to comments, that kind of thing. Uh, I also, there's also a PeerTube instance, uh, and I'll put a link to that here in the description. Uh, and that, that's like an alternative to YouTube that's decentralized peer-to-peer, -peer, really, really cool concept. So there's definitely that to check out, given the quota size. I don't upload much to that. You know, these people don't have infinite storage like Google seemingly does, so they can't let you store as much video, and that's completely understandable. So if you know of any other platforms you'd like me to be on, just let me know. If I don't like the terms of service, though I'm not signing up, uh, I don't like YouTube's terms of service, but it's a big enough thing that you just kind of live with it. So, all right, your thoughts let me know. If you think of other reasons why there might have been a thumbs down, definitely leave a comment.